Have you ever stared at a mountain of sheets you need to build? Like floor plans, roof plans, sections and thoughts. What if I never had to create all these sheets manually? Well, buckle up because today we're tackling exactly that. Now, why is manual sheet creation so universally dreaded? It's not like we're lazy, it's because this type of work is a perfect storm of monotony and inevitability. You might wonder, what is the problem with formatting some sheets? Do you know a 40-story skyscraper can need up to 2,000 sheets? It's a big requirement. Without these sheets ready before construction, chaos ensues. So, this work is necessary, but it's nature, that's where things get really frustrating. The tasks themselves are repetitive. Think formatting sheets, numbering them appropriately, adjusting layouts. It's the same steps over and over again. We all want to focus on exciting stuff, like brainstorming new designs or solving big challenges. But instead, we get bogged down in routine work, which drains time and energy. So, while he's drowning, let's deep dive to know how to solve this problem. Every project needs multiple sheets, flow plans for layouts, roof plans for coverage and sections for detailed cuts. Designing them requires ideation, planning, developing models and details. And no matter the type of sheet, the final step is always creating those sheets in the right format. So can tech help us here? We know good tech solves a well-defined problem. Here, we can clarify the problem in detail. Essentially, there's a boring task, but it's important to notice that it's a repetitive task. Repetition is a red flag for inefficiency. So, can we fix this specific problem? Enter automation, the act of making something happen on its own. Imagine setting up a machine that runs itself while you enjoy a coffee. Let's look at a real-world example here. You might have seen assembly lines in the car manufacturing industries. No human is required as the machines keep churning out car after car. But is it always mechanical automation? Let's understand the concept better. Have you ever used an ATM? You know it stands for Automated Teller Machine. Automated being the keyword here. A teller is a bank employee who deals with customer transactions. ATM automates the process of a teller. This is done by the machine by following an order of predefined questions which the customer chooses. A repetitive task made easier without the human intervention of an actual bank teller. So should we automate everything? Not everything can or should be automated. We brainstorm new ideas in the beginning, which is repeated in every project, and we keep solving problems along the way. They cannot be automated easily. Let's see a Venn diagram of tasks. Some need little human intervention, but are not repetitive, like adjusting air conditioning or navigating while driving. Some are repetitive tasks, but need human judgment, like grading essays and quality checking. And there are tasks that are outside both circles, like creative design and critical decision making which are non-repetitive and need human judgment. We have to understand that automation thrives in this overlap right here. Repetitive tasks that need little to no human intervention. So let's zoom back to our original problem, creating sheets. The steps are repetitive. Decide the format, fill the correct information, number them, adjust layouts and cross-check everything. We know the numbers always go from one and the company name goes on every sheet. There are flow numbers and room numbers which we already entered as information while modeling. So we're pretty sure we have that information already. We can write additional information in an Excel sheet. We can design a simple format and layout template which is a one-time effort we need to repeat. As we understand the requirement, we can see a solution forming here. Imagine consolidating all the steps under one button. Sounds dreamy, right? Here's the good news. Tech like Dynamo exists. This software is a beast. It has way too many features like data analysis, collaboration, and it definitely includes automation. An important aspect of Dynamo is that it's a visual programming software, which means it lets you work on it visually. No coding required. For automation, take this node. It inputs sheet data and outputs fully formatted sheets. Magic, right? You can create sheets with a fixed format, title bar, efficient layouts, number, and edit all of them easily. All flow plans can be generated in a second. Once again, tech finds a solution for our problem. When given the right procedure and instruction, people can build automated systems. Next time you're stuck doing repetitive tasks, ask yourself, can I automate this? The more time you save, the more you can focus on creative and engaging parts of your work. So in a nutshell, whenever a need arises, a process like automation or a process like BIM evolves to create solutions. To further know how automation and BIM solve such problems in the AC industry, be sure to subscribe to Novator. See you in the next episode. 
and don't forget to ask questions